Welcome to this week's Wise Word and today we are with Njoro Precious Girls High School and we are talking about a topic that seems close to their hearts. We have seen it in their spoken word and in their drama and it is repentance. And we want them to tell us uh, what is repentance and why it is important to repent and they'll give us instances when they repented and it made a difference in their lives. So we'll start with what is repentance. Yes. Repentance is moving from, is making a step. You are, you are moved from one stage to another. That is from from be, from worse to good or better. Yes. Uh huh. Yes. As for me, repentance is uh, asking God for forgiveness and turning away from evil. Exactly. Uh huh. Yes. I do think repentance is changing your wicked path and walking in the holy path. Exactly. Uh -huh. As for me, I think repentance is to turn away from sin so that God can forgive us and and welcome us back to the His better. Okay. Mm -hmm. As for me, I think repentance is turn, turning from bad ways to good ways and following God. Okay. Uh huh. Yes. Repentance is when a person moves from a wicked way and decides to follow Jesus Christ. Okay. Yes, and that is true. Repentance is turning away from one thing and going towards another and never going back to the thing that you've left behind. So they have told us exactly that. The second one we want to hear about why it is important to repent. Uh, where do we start? Why do you think it's important to repent? It's important to repent so that because uh, if you don't repent, when you go to heaven, you'll be, you will be judged, and you, 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 Jesus will not come back and die for us again because he wants to die now. He cannot come back to die again the second time. Mm -hmm. Yes. Uh huh. Yes. As you all know, we are all human and we are all sinners. When we repent, we our relationship with God becomes stronger. Exactly. Uh huh. I think it's important so that we can all see the kingdom of heaven since no one wants to go to hell. Exactly. No one wants to go to hell. Uh huh. Any other? Okay. So now for our final question, the girls are going to tell us uh, an instance when they repented and what difference it made in their lives and in the lives of the people maybe that were involved. I'll start with you. Uh, I can remember some few years behind there, I used to be rude, not listening to my teachers, my parents, whatever they would tell me, I would just ignore them. But one day when we were seated with my cousins, it happened that one of my cousins talked and he was, he was more grown up more than me. So, Nikam Jibu. Sir, I kunia kele a coffee, but my other cousin told him, Muachan and Tunim Dogo. But he came and told me, Esther, you need to change, do this, do this. And from that day, I decided to repent, change my ways, and listen to my teachers. Because by then, I saw they have no use, I have no use to them, mm -hmm. and they can do nothing to me. Mm -hmm. So I repented, and now I, can, I do listen to them, and I've changed. But even in the grades, I've improved. Okay, that's good. Uh, we are going to hear another, one more. Yes, long ago I, I have been taking things for granted. I was just ignoring anything that someone told me. Like there's a day I, I, I sat down with my friends, then they told me I avoid bad companies. Then I just ignored and said it's my life, so it's not a must I follow what they're saying. Now when there's a day I came and sat down and said that if I don't stop I, if I don't listen, if I don't listen to these people mm -hmm. one day in my life I'll come to regret so I just said it's better I go and ask them for forgiveness I change my life and I ask God to help me because if I don't ask him to help me and the time of exam when exam time comes I, I only need him at that time so I just said I, I should always be needed 
I should always need him at all times. Now I just decided to repent. I asked him for God to forgive me for all my sins. Mm -hmm. And now my life has changed. Okay. We have been talking with uh, jo the girls from Joro Precious High School. And they have told us about repentance and the importance of repentance. The actual word repentance uh, means that you turn away, you leave your house you leave it, you burn it down, and then you go away, and you never return to that house again. So, and the Bible tells us, because all have sinned and fallen short of the glory of God, we are told in Matthew chapter 3 verse 2, that repent, for the kingdom of heaven is at hand. Therefore, this is our message to you, uh, this for this holiday from Joro Precious, that we should repent, so that our lives will take a good turn, and that we'll reach our destiny. God bless you. I will see you next week and keep watching. with Njoro Precious Girls High School and we have been talking about which topic? Being like-minded with Christ. Yes. And we want to see what notes that the girls have been taking throughout the service and the show. We'll start from that end. The mind of Christ is makes one to be prayerful because mm -hmm. even Jesus was prayerful in his ministry. Yes. And one from this side. We have learned about humility and obedience. Maybe I'm, I'm encouraging the youth at home to obey their parents during long holidays. Exactly. We have also learned that the mind of Christ is bold, so we should emulate Christ in our lives. Yes. And we hope that you also at home have been taking notes together with us. Remember to follow us on Facebook, on YouTube, and on Instagram at Roy's for Christ. Give us your feedback about the show, about what you think about Njoro Precious uh, Girls High School, and tell us generally what you think about MBCI. Also, if you'd like us to visit your institution, contact us on the number that is appearing on your screen. Till next Saturday, where we shall be in a different school, but at the same time, God bless you, Shalom! We are going for a break. We have still much. Hey. <laughs>